Hello, this is Blue Storm Wyvern, and I'm storming at you with a new review. And today I'm bringing you the collector's edition of Assassin's Creed Valhalla, the latest in the Assassin's Creed series. So in this game you get to play as a Viking named Eivor, and you can choose whether you want the character to be either male or female. Personally, I like the brother-sister aspect a little bit better. But in any way, they're going to do what they're going to do. So to start off, take a look at the this little bag here. Start small. And inside is what is supposed to be a little wooden totem of the male version. So there's that. Next is the selected game soundtrack. You see here, in this game, your bird companion is a raven. So, there's the runes for that. <clears throat> of course, you got the Assassin's Creed Valhalla logo there. And, of course, on the back, you have all of the tracks. It looks like there's 14 of them. So just pause the video to look at them. So there's those. And of course, you got the Ubisoft logo there with a, another Viking rune up on top. So there's that. Next is the ultimate edition of the game in a nice little steel book. And once again, you got the Ubisoft logo there. And this game's rated M for mature, so my my suggestion is you have to be at least 17 or or older to play it because there's a lot of blood and gore in these games and Vikings are no different. And on the back, you have some still shots. If you don't mind the glare. But there is all that. Let's see, what does it say here? Become a legendary Viking raider. And then that's just an, so it says the same thing in another language. Of course, it's done by Havoc and DTS and is Dolby Digital Audio. And of course these games are single player. And of course there's the spine. And it says that on both sides. So before I continue, I don't know if that helps any, but I just turned on another lamp. Alright, so now to take a look at the box. Of course, you got the Assassin's Creed logo in a Viking style with some with a big ring with dragons on it. Oh, I guess I should probably show you the disc too for the soundtrack before I do that. So here's what the disc looks like. Got some more Viking runes and a couple of ravens on there. Okay. So now again, the box. Again, you got the Assassin's Creed logo in the Viking rune style with a couple of dragons and two more ravens there. And then I guess a very faint rune on the background. I don't know if that can be seen, but if you can see that, there we go. There's that. And of course it's got the same thing there and right there. And on the back you get a Raven in Flight rune with the Assassin's Creed logo in the, Vi in the Viking style. Okay, now to crack this egg open. So 
there is the statue. Take a look at her in a moment. But here is the certificate of authenticity. And my number for here is 27775. So he's got a nice picture there of a Viking warship. And he's got the same two Raven art, rune artwork there on the sail that's on the soundtrack. And right there is the art cards. So pull that out. Okay, so on the envelope there you got the same runes again. Oh, that same background rune, different raven runes on the sides, and of course the same Viking style of the logo. And there it is again on the cover. I don't want to ruin this envelope because it's really nice. And it's just part of the collection. And you get three little art cards. So there's the first one. We've got a castle and some dark skies there. And it looks like you got a little put together here. Um, but there's the second one. Nice little landscape. And ah, so and there is the final one. Let's see what do we got here? Oh, they're coming. Ash it's them coming ashore on a snowy beach. But it looks like. Oh yeah, if you overlap the Oh, I see. So this turns over like that. This goes, I guess this goes in the middle. Trying to figure all this out. I think I got it figured out. But more or less, I guess that's what it looks like when it's all put together. So there is that. Put these back. Alright, so now I'm going to take a look at the statue, the big one. Put everything over here. Alright, let's see. Yep, it's got some tape on it.
Yeah, I pre-ordered this quite a while back. And unfortunately, I don't have the male version of the big statue yet, but I'm going to work on that. And also the blade, the hidden blade that you usually put on your wrist. Okay, so here is the axe that she'll hold. And here is the female Eivor on a on the mast of a Viking warship. The axe should go in her hand. Hold on a sec, I'm gonna just take her off camera here so that I can wedge this thing in there. Okay. So there she is with the axe. And here is the raven companion that your character comes with. And that goes right on right in there on the mast of the ship this little notch on the tail just like that okay so there you have it and I pre-ordered this from the place uh, from the uh, Ubisoft store, which is where a lot of them tend to go, because that seems to be the only place you can get them. Yeah, the last time I pre ordered one of these collector's editions from GameStop was when Unity came out, and that was a while back. So, but in any case, so there is the collector's edition for Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, I'm, and I'm hoping that the next one will be Feudal Japan. Ubisoft make that happen. That would be totally cool. So, uh, yeah, but until then... We'll be enjoying this. I still, I know, shame on me, I still need to play Odyssey. Because I'm into ancient Greek. But let's take another look at the stat, the big statue here. The female Ivor. Really nice detailing. Got some runes along the mast. And of course right along here. And she's got the two ravens on her shield there, and the wild haircut, and the runes on her on the side of her head. And she, she looks like she's ready to go to battle. Okay, well, so there you have it. This was my unboxing of the collector's edition of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And once I can get the wolf kissed statue, which is the male version standing on a chest of gold and the wrist blade, I'll review those together if I can. So until then, as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.